Hello and welcome to this week's episode. We're going to talk about the endocannabinoid system. What is the endocannabinoid system? The endocannabinoid system, or ECS for short, is a complex cell signaling system in the body that is responsible for maintaining homeostasis or balance in virtually every system in the body. The ECS was identified in 1992 by Professor Raphael Meculum and his researchers who were exploring exactly how the cannabinoid THC works in the body. The endocannabinoid system plays a role in your body's functions such as sleep, mood, appetite, memory, reproduction and fertility. There are three main parts of the endocannabinoid system. Endocannabinoid molecules, cannabinoid receptors and enzymes. Endocannabinoid molecules. Endocannabinoids are molecules made by your body. The two known endocannabinoids are 2-AG and anandamide. These help keep the body's internal functions running smoothly. Your body produces them as needed, so it's hard to keep track if there's a deficiency. Cannabinoid receptors. The cannabinoid receptors around our body are called CB1 and CB2. CB1 receptors are mostly found in the central nervous system. CB2 receptors are mostly found in the peripheral nervous system, especially immune cells. Endocannabinoids can bind to either receptor. The results depend on where the receptor is located and which endocannabinoid it binds to. Enzymes. There are two main enzymes, fatty acid amide hydrolase and monoacylglycerol acid lipase. These are responsible for creating endocannabinoids, transporting them to our receptors and breaking down endocannabinoids once they have performed their function. Research has linked the endocannabinoid system to the following processes, appetite and digestion, metabolism, chronic pain, inflammation, mood, learning and memory, motor control, sleep, cardiovascular system function, muscle formation, bone remodeling and growth, liver function, stress, reproductive system function, skin and nerve function. Ways to give your endocannabinoid system a boost. Take a cannabinoid supplement like CBD. Try aerobic exercise. Add cacao or maca roots to your diet. Look for other herbs with cannabinoid properties and supplement omega-3. The endocannabinoid system is still significantly underestimated and is still being researched today. We highly recommend you do some extra research because we haven't even scratched the surface in this video. This is just basic knowledge to help you get started. Thanks for joining us on today's episode. We hope you learned something new. Please like, subscribe and ding the bell so you don't miss future uploads.